Good afternoon, and praise be to the Lord and Jesus Christ. Today's reading is from Isaiah, Isaiah 21. An oracle concerning the wilderness of the sea. As windstorms in Negev swept on, it comes from a wilderness from a terrifying land. A harsh vision has been sown to me. The treacherous one still deals treacherously, and the destroyer still destroys. Go up, Alam, lay siege, Media. Have made an end of all my groaning she has caused. For this reason my loins are full of anguish. Pains have seized me like the pains of a woman in labor. I am so bewildered I cannot hear, so terrified I cannot see. My mind reels, horror overwhelms me. The twilight I long for has been turned for me into trembling. They set the table, they spread out the cloth, they eat, they drink. Rise up, captains, oil the shields, for thus the Lord says to me, Go station the lookout, let him report what he sees. And when he sees riders, horsemen in pairs, a train of donkeys, a train of camels, let him pay close attention, very close attention. Then the lookout called, O Lord, I stand continually by day by day the watchtower, and I am stationed every night at my guard post. Now behold, here comes a troop of riders, horsemen in pairs, and one answered and said, Fallen, fallen in Babylon, and all the images of her gods are shattered on the ground. On my threshold people and my afflicted of the threshing floor, what I have heard from the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, I make known to you the oracle concerning Edom. One keeps calling to me from Seir, Watchman, how far gone is the night? Watchman, how far gone is the night? The watchman says, Morning comes, but also night. If you would inquire, inquire. Come back again. The oracle about Arabia. In the thickets of Arabia you must spend the night O caravans of Dedanites, bring water for the thirsty. O inhabitants of the land of Tema, meet the fugitive with bread, for they have fled from the swords, from the, from the drawn sword and from the bent bow, and from the press of battle. For thus the Lord said to me, In a year as a hired man would count it, all the splendor of Kedar will terminate, and the remainder of the number of bowmen, the mighty men of the sons of Kedar, will be few, for the Lord God of Israel has spoken. Praise be the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. <laughs> 